whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. My name is Lüning, Horst Lüning, I'm the master taster of whiskey.com and today we have a new whiskey, a whiskey from a new distillery here in my cask. It's the Filé or Filé, Filé Bay STR, a 0.7 liter bottle, 46% ABV, unchill filtered, roughly priced around 70 and it's from England, mm, not Scotland, England. So it's the spirit of Yorkshire distillery where they produce that and Yorkshire is well two-thirds on the way <laughs> up to Scotland and on the east coast at this Filet Bay the distillery is located and uh, this mm, Yorkshire region is known as the the big barley producing uh, region in Great Britain. So they are sitting just in between the barley fields and uh, the city of Leeds, the biggest town there, is uh, quite a distance away, so they are in a rural uh, region. Yeah, this uh, distillery has a special production process and as I if I understand it right here on the card box, uh, they have, uh, use 100% homegrown barley from their own farm. Then uh, they are steeping and malting their barley themselves and then mill mashing, fermented, and they use the water from deep below the distillery. I've had another distillery uh, lately where they pumped up the water from very deep below and that water is chalk filtered yeah and then they have a special a distillation process consisting out of two pot stills and a rectifier here you see a picture of that a distilling process there is a reflux probably uh, in between that and uh, then of course they are uh, maturing the whiskey in specially selected cask. Well, every cask is specially selected, uh, but from all around the world. And this one is an STR cask. What does that mean? STR, uh, shaved, toasted and recharred. So it's a rejuvenated cask where you uh, grind out the old charcoal in a cladding of the cask and then you're toasting it to uh, caramelize the wood sugars or to cut the cellulosis into wood sugars and then caramelize the wood sugars and after that you flame it, uh, you rechar it for getting the charcoal on the inside which is filtering the sharp substances out of the whiskey. Uh, there's no age statement on it. Uh, it's not too old I think, probably three years. Uh, what do they say here? Uh, light floral and fruity with notes of summer berries, vanilla, ice cream, orange chocolate and toasted oak. From field to bottle in the North Yorkshire coast near Filey Bay, England. We make exceptional whiskey with respect for tradition but created our own way. We use homegrown barley and water sourced from our farm to create Filey Bay single malt whiskey proudly made of Yorkshire. So tradition, well, I think in the past, in the past centuries, there had been as many <laughs> distilleries in England as there had been in Scotland, but they weren't producing whiskey. I think uh, they mostly produced gin in former times. Yeah. Smells like whiskey, is whiskey. So the cork has a metal inlet. And here we go. Light and floral. Vanilla, lots of vanilla. Sweet, little juicy, little orange juice. Summer berries, red berries, light and floral. This is uncomplicated. 
but it's definitely a whiskey. And I'm warming up the glass a little bit because the glass had been cold and the whiskey had been room temperature. So probably I cooled the whiskey a little bit down with these, this cold glass. Yeah. Vanilla, vanilla ice cream, as they said on the label. Yes, I find that. Yeah. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a typical whiskey we know from the other part of Great Britain. <laughs> yeah, there is a little bit uh, of young oakiness in it, aromatic oakiness. So this. Uh, shaved, toasted and recharred casks had been old red wine casks but uh, don't look on that red wine because if you shave it, if you toast it and if you rechar that then the red wine is gone completely. So it's the wood and red wine typically comes from mm, Limousin oak from France, probably might be uh, and this aromatic note is in it. Yeah. There is a second whiskey uh, from Filo Bay out there with a Moscatel finish. I'm uh, tasting that right afterwards. So stay tuned. In upcoming days or weeks, there will be the second one. Uh, and probably this is a, a, a oaky intense one, uh, not the long oak maturation which leads to bitterness but the younger uh, aromatic oak maturation yeah oranges yeah mm -hmm. yeah for a first of a distillery of a new distillery this is quite good they made a good job and probably this special rectifier uh, hinders the whiskies uh, for being that young and metallic and everything you're <laughs> having to say bad about young whiskey. This rectifier might be produce a smoother whiskey, like a triple distillation probably. Yeah, thank you for watching. Stay tuned. There's more to come.